Yo, yo, what is going on, everybody? It is D-Man coming back at it again with another YouTube video. And today, I'm going to be going over all the heavyweights in the game. Um, and tomorrow, I'm actually going to open up this Twitch bundle pack. Uh, I got this from last night. Watch the stream with Derwin James versus the world. Uh, I try and remind you guys every Tuesday to go ahead and, and hop into that um, elite card. Okay, we'll take it. We'll take elites out of the Twitch pack, baby. Let's go. <clears throat> Excuse me, but like I was saying, Derwin James versus the world. Uh, Y'all need to go and watch the stream for at least, um, at least, I think it's an hour and a half. I think they cut it down because two hours was like way too long. Um, but an hour and a half is how long I watched it for. And I'm getting, I'm not going to say anything yet because I haven't got my token. But yeah, but again, like I'm saying, like I was saying, uh, you get your... Um, your token out of one of these packs. Um, so yeah, here it is with no animation. So there's your crown that you need to go ahead and complete the set to go ahead and dang a lot of goals in here. Oh yeah, we'll take that. But like I said, you need that token to go ahead and throw into the Derwin James vs. The World set to go ahead and, and at the end of when Derwin James vs. The World finishes, you're going to get a 97 overall Derwin James that's going to be auctionable and tradable, which is really cool. So uh, I think we do have one more Twitch to pack, so let's go ahead and open that up. So we, oh wrong pack uh oh but i'm gonna go ahead and hop into um into uh the heavyweight cards we have today i'll go ahead and go to the store um and show you guys the pack so we did get a little different pack here uh as you guys can see right here under training 4500 training for an 89 90 overall heavyweight player so i uh so yeah so this is Okay, I believe 90 overalls, yeah, 90 overalls, quick sell for 5,000 training. Um, so if you do pull a 90 overall out of this pack, you you make 500 training. But if you pull an 89, they quick sell for 3,600, so you lose 900. So um, again, gamble pack here, rerolls. Um, I haven't, you know, I haven't even tried this. I'm probably not going to, because um, you know EA does not like to give you the, the you know 90 overalls much, but um, it could be profitable if you're lucky. Uh, but I wouldn't re-roll this set at all, uh, but this is really just to get you, you know, an 89 and 90 overall uh, exchange set, and, and people actually found out of, that we were getting heavyweights uh, last, or I should say yesterday afternoon, uh, because on the heavyweights pack, it actually had an expiration time on it, so it said like, you know, 14 hours, 13 hours remaining on the pack, so people were like, okay, we're getting heavyweights tomorrow, so a uh, good thing to look out for next week too, so let's go ahead and hop into Oh, like obviously like next week we might get veterans or, or rising stars or flashbacks something like that so we could easily just look at the pack and you know see if we see a timer uh or, or a time remaining on that to see what we uh you know we're, what we're getting um the next day before it even you know they even tweet out uh you know an image of a player that we're getting but let's go ahead and hop into this can we sort by 90s yes we can so um we did get an upgrade with Jarrell Casey um if you guys do follow me on Instagram, I believe one of y'all asked me a question on Instagram. Um, hopefully, we get like a Roger Saffold, I believe. And with us getting teased, um, the Demarcus Lawrence, I was like, okay, so we got all offensive linemen last time. I was thinking we were going to get all defensive linemen, which we did, except for one card, which is a fullback. But we'll get into that a little bit later. But um, I think one of y'all said uh, Roger Saffold, and I was like, you know, unfortunately, I think it's going to be all D linemen, but we could see a Jarrell Casey, and we did. So this is an awesome upgrade here. Um, the, the card looks pretty good, guys. You know, obviously, he's going to be a little slow, um, but his block shed, tackle strength, play rec is all above 90. And once we power him up, kim him up, he's going to look even better. So, you know, 69 speed, 78 excel, you know, we can deal with that with Jarrell Casey. I might even move him to D tackle, and... Uh, well, probably not. I'll keep him at end because we don't have another end. But 90 strength, 90 tackle, 92 play rec, block shed is 90, power move 79, finesse move 86. But those two are okay. Uh, we'll kim him up. He'll be really good on the team. 284 still. Impact block is 93, which is awesome. Um, card looks really good. Uh, other than the speed aspect, but, you know, we can deal with that. We, we run an 81 overall drill Casey anyway, so... We should be fine there. Definitely, um, uh, um, I shouldn't say much, much needed upgrade, but you know, we'll take it. Next, we got Grady Jarrett here, 67 speed, 81 excel, 85 speed, 89 tackle, uh, play rex 90, block shed 88, power move 92, and finesse move is 77. So high power move, low finesse. Um, so I mean, yeah, 
solid card here for Falcons fans. Um, impact block 88. All right, you know, another solid card. Again, like last year, you know, heavyweights, veterans, flashbacks um, weren't, you know, unless you were running a theme team at the beginning of the year, they weren't the most usable cards. So thank goodness EA, um, you know, made these at 90 overall. We did get that plus one boost too. So here's Kenny Clark, 67 speed for, you know, going from an 89 to 90 overall. Like, you know, heavyweights were an 89, now we're up to a 90. So uh, here's Kenny Clark. We got 67 speed, 79 excel, 91 strength, 87 tackle, play rex 90, block shed 90, power move 87, and finesse move is 69. So another, I mean, these these cards are usable, guys. These cards are, are very usable, and there's another one I want to go ahead and go over, Demarcus Lawrence. This Demarcus Lawrence are, <clears throat> looks really good. Um, you know, I... <laughs> He, he's definitely not playing well this year, like, in real life. But, you know, this card looks really good with 79 speed, 86 acceleration, 85 strength, 84 tackling, play rex 89, block shed 86, power move is 87, and finesse move is 92. So those last three there, block shed, power move, finesse move, mainly you might see two of those stats be very high, the other low. Uh, maybe you see block shed, power move high, um, and, and then and finesse move low. Or maybe you see block shed finesse move high and then power move low. But on this card, uh, you know, across the board, it's all even, which is really good. Um, speed rusher, too. He's got good speed for a defensive end, especially having block shed power move and finesse move being pretty much, you know, top tier um, ratings wise. Um, and then having the speed on top of it, which is, you know, pretty good. So this Demarcus Lawrence, as y'all saw, was going for a little bit more than the other cards. Um, but yeah, that, that's. These cards are really solid, guys. Um, especially if you're on a theme team. Pretty big upgrades for, for certain theme teams out there. Patrick Ricard here with set. This is a new fullback, like I said. I thought we were going to get all D linemen. Uh, we pretty much did, but we got a fullback too. We did need a fullback. The last fullback we had was Mike Allstott. Uh, so here's Patrick Ricard. 77 speed, 87 strength, 90 awareness. Carrying is 86. Catching 68. Run block, which is important. It's 87. Lead block, which is more important. 93 in impact block, uh, as much as important as, as, as lead block is uh, at 92. So, um, this car is very good too. Uh, the only difference here with the, you know, comparing him to Mike Allstott, who is the other 91 overall fullback we have, obviously we need power him up, uh, power Ricard up, he's going to be a 91. Uh, the only um, bad thing is the speed on Ricard, it's going to be like minus 9, I think, or minus 8 once you power him up. I believe Mike Allstott has 86 speed once you have Mike Allstott powered up. Um, but yeah, that's the big thing. Do you do you if you run stretch a lot, you're gonna go want to go with Mike Allstott. If you run, you know, inside zone, ISO, trap, well, you don't really use a fullback for trap, but uh, y'all get what I'm saying. If you're running up the middle, you, if you use a fullback in those formations, um, Ricard is the guy for you. Um, and then, you know, obviously if you're gonna stretch outside zone, anything, you know, going, you know, having to, you know, get to the outside, you're gonna want Mike Allstott to get to the outside with his speed. So, Patrick Ricard is still a very good fullback, you know, really good lead block, really good impact block. Uh, the speed is okay, but it's not quite there. Um, so, I mean, yeah. Solid at trucking 81, stiff arm 77. You could even hand them off, uh, you know, a bunch of people use their fullbacks on the goal line. Uh, it, you can use Ricard on the goal line if y'all wanted to. Um, but yeah, there's Ricard for y'all. Um, and yeah, let's see if we can snag this right quick. 95k for Jarrell. Okay, we'll take Jarrell. We'll go ahead and upgrade him actually. Let's get him. Actually, we won't be able to because I only have 387 training. But um, the next theme team video, y'all will see uh, Derek Henry and Jarrell Casey. So, um, and look, and I'm going to actually schedule a video for tomorrow most fear predictions actually well yeah it'll be a predictions video pretty much but um it's gonna be me talking um if you haven't seen if you don't follow me on instagram please do because i just posted you know the leak uh gamestop actually posted on their instagram uh most feared image uh which was troy palomalu and i'm actually going to record that tonight i'm going to schedule it for tomorrow um and then later tonight i will have the ltd players or I should say player that they tweet out tonight. I will post a video on that. Yeah, and like I said, expect a video tomorrow going over most feared and everything you need to know, investments and all that good stuff. So 
Expect that tomorrow. Expect the LTD video coming out later tonight. And yeah, that's going to be it for the video. Hope y'all enjoyed. Right at 10 minutes. Till next time, I'll see y'all.